Hey, it's your girl Sunshine. I'm here with Neil Nobly. They're black and I were walking through the African Festival of the Arts and I had to take two steps back. The art here is absolutely gorgeous. I'm here with Neil Nobly. He's just going to take us through their booth and show us some of this very authentic art that they have here. Hi, how are you today, Neil? Very well. I'm doing very well. Thanks for coming in. Thanks for taking time to speak with us. Tell us about the art you guys have here. Well, first tell us about your two business names. Okay, yes. We have two Two businesses. One is Short Street, uh, Stuart McLean Gallery, and the second one is South Street Nation. And it represents not only the visual arts, but what we do with the wearable art and the clothing and the designs. So Stuart McLean is the artist. He does all the designs and all the production of the work that he, you, you see in the gallery. Works with very colorful stuff as well as very earth tone stuff. Yeah. I see. All right, so um, tell us about the um, what's behind the art here. I see the texture, and it's just absolutely gorgeous. And you told me before, there are no replicas. Everything you get is an original. Absolutely. So the medium he uses is acrylic on canvas. Okay. It, re it represents a lot of the liveliness of the Caribbean. We are actually from Trinidad in the Caribbean, and he lives uh, in New Orleans right now. So he represents a lot of his work, his visual work, represents is representative of the experience he's had in the Caribbean the very colorful uh, colors on the artwork he uses the experiences he had from things like carnival uh, things like um, the jazz experience in New Orleans he's lived in Atlanta he's lived in New York okay and all his work is representative of his past uh, his, his background and what he's what he brings to the table right. I definitely saw the background in art and music especially music over here we're gonna take a walk over here and as a mom of a young artist I immediately saw the artwork here uh, with music tell us more about this here this is just absolutely gorgeous these are some of the gold earth tone colors right and a lot of it is representative of jazz and the mixture of the musical instruments with jazz and then what he does is intermixes as well the African experience. So you see a lot of masks in his work, as well as some of the feathers that are representative in the carnival experience in Trinidad. Um, you know, jazz instruments, uh, masks, carnival, all comes together in the canvas. Right? Gorgeous, gorgeous. All right, and then we're going to let you go in just a minute, but the t-shirts and hats. Let's take a look at that really quick and explain what we have here. So, so there's visual artwork, which is a fine art that he does, and he works with the acrylic media on canvas. But he also takes that medium and transfers it to wearable art. So he uses uh, the hand-painted, um, same designs that you've seen, I'm sorry, same designs that you see on the, on the uh, canvas, he puts it in, in wearable media, such as the, the t-shirts, the hats, like I'm wearing right, right now, uh, as well as he does if you can walk around this way. He also does leather work, so he works with, with handbags, purse, uh, pillows, and these are all designed by Stuart and hand sewn by Stuart. So he's not only a visual artist, but he also does a lot of creative work with his hands. And he actually started doing his work uh, sewing leather, leather goods. You know, he did sandals and belts, accessories, uh, and then migrated to the visual arts. His experiences took him towards visual arts, and then he started doing some paintings. On this wall, you'll see some of the, the work that we've done in silk screen. So these are those that you had seen before were one of a kind. Those were original hand painted. These are these are there are five designs that we've done that we've done silk screens and the technique that we use. Uh, puff paints, silk screens with puff paints. So the art actually looks like it's coming off uh, the the the, uh, the the t-shirt itself. It's very really like three-dimensional effect. And again, you'll see some of the caps as well. These are all one-of-a-kind caps that he uses acrylic media. This is all absolutely gorgeous. Now, can you tell us where our listeners can find um, the artwork, the shirts? Okay. So our website is coming. It's going to be called SouthStreetNation.com. 
and it'll be up in two weeks uh, and we'll have all the all the stuff that he has on the on the website but he also does a lot of shows now he's done he's done this this uh, festival for 20 years he's come back 20 years on right here and he's, it's actually one of his most favorite ones that he's done he's done very very good he's got very good reception here in chicago so he loves chicago so he's even thinking of moving to chicago and he, right now he's in new orleans as i mentioned he loves this city so much that we may have a gallery coming here soon well we will definitely be looking forward to that and we'll be in contact and we'll also keep our listeners posted on that website when it becomes available thank you so much for your time today thank you so much for coming All Right, and Dirt Black, if you could just pan over the artist some stuff, he's over there taking care of business. But there he is. If he could just give us a wave, or he's busy. Okay, but that's him right there, guys. The man and the legend. <laughs> All right. All right. Thanks, and we'll take you guys to another vendor. Thank you.